The sudden death of Osceola Christian student athlete Dakota Hagen has rocked their small community. But as Dom Tibbetts tells us, they're remembering Dakota for the memories he created and the faith he helped spread as a warrior. A few short months ago, the Fellowship of Christian Athletes held the field of faith at Osceola Christian. It was there senior Dakota Hagen spoke the words of Proverbs verses 5 through 6. And since then, thousands have found comfort in the message he delivered that night. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. In all that ways, acknowledge Him, and He shall not break that path. For thousands of people to be able to hear that, even after His passing, it's just very powerful. And it's you know, something we're taking comfort in, knowing where He's at, and then, uh, how He's continued to impact people as well. A three-sport athlete, Dakota, was a competitor. He liked to win, and as Trip Joyner can attest to, was always someone you could count on to make a play. There was a play on a homecoming night. You know, I I rolled out and I saw his hand. You know, kind of trying to tell me he was open. And uh, there was a fender in my face, and I was getting tackled kind of as I threw it. And uh, you know, I hit the ground, and I heard everybody screaming and cheering and cheerleaders jumping. And I looked up, and I saw Coda giving the ball to the ref. Off the field in court, Dakota was as charismatic as they come, always with an infectious smile that radiated to everyone he met. One of the things that Dakota would always do is he, he, he'd always smile. He was always smiling, but he would also do a little wink deal, and he'd wink at you. His death is not an easy one to cope with, but the way he lived his life through Christ is what everyone will remember the most. Now, we know where he's at. We have a you know, relationship with Jesus Christ. And he's our Lord and Savior. We want to see him again. Yeah, just remembering who he was and remembering that he wouldn't want us to be sad, and he'd want sports to carry on and just play hard for God. At Osceola Christian, Dom Tibbetts, ABC 27. Uh, now the Warriors are planning to stitch the letters DH7 in their hats in honor of Hagen this season, as well as undershirts that will have the Proverbs 3, 5 through 6, just like Dakota quoted in his Fields of Faith testimony.